9.03. I gotta be real quiet because that dough is still bedding. right there when I was coming in this morning I pulled down this way and I park right there well right about in front of me right about here is that buck that I have on video that I've been looking for that eight pointer he went down this way across the creek in here somewhere it was dark yet it was like six o'clock but he was walking right down the side of the road in the grass right here and then I had some does which one of them is that one probably over there um, milling around in this yard right here had one over here um, they were out moving like crazy earlier but by 8 30 8 15 uh, they just bed down this one flopped down right there and has not moved just sitting there there is uh, a kid or someone up here talking on the phone and there's some kids you know playing like little kids she ain't moving guy cutting the grass uh, they're just so used to people but as soon as you step in the woods it's all over so as soon as I lower my bow down she's gonna get up and bolt but the bucks are not chasing yet he was more in a hurry to get into the woods and hide because uh, he was running late and that's what my trail camera's been saying. He comes through earliest is 8 o'clock at night. And then the latest I've seen him on trail camera is about 6. And that's on that property out this way. So he probably came through or like 5 o'clock, 5.30. Came down this way. And it goes behind me over this way. Into that, like there's like 50 acres behind me. Really thick and nasty. I mean, there's probably spots like this. But you never know. Anyway, she ain't moving. I'm going to have to bust her out of here soon. Alrighty, guys. There's my trail camera on the tree right there. Just checking to see what comes through here in the middle of the night and whatnot. See when they're moving. They seem to use this hillside. Like I've said before, they like to come up this, you know, through this flat here and up from the yard over there. So, I just want to see what's coming around here. I have not had anything come up behind me. I was hoping some dose would and that buck would follow him coming this way to bed. I told you in front of me is that bedding and the one in back of me. I'm kind of right between them. But uh, he was in a hurry. He wasn't running, but he was in a fast trot getting down the road and then dipped into the woods. He knew he was running late. She still ain't up on her feet. <laughs> and it's nine o'clock. I got things to do, girl. I want her to get out of here so I don't scare her. But it's going to have to happen. I'm almost thinking. That tree in there. I'm almost thinking of trying that one. It's a little thicket right there. And they come in this bottom. They cut across this bottom. Across the creek right around here. Either over here or over here. And I'd be able to get a, I don't know what that looks like, about a 20 yard shot if they come out of the yard, cut through this flat there. They're crossing this, uh, I mean, they're up on this hill just a bit, really. I don't think they're walking it much. So I may move over there. I'll check that out. All right. Everybody have a great day.
and Saturday, opening day of muzzleloader here in Virginia. But uh, I'm still bow hunting in the city here and in some other spots. Talk to you guys later. Be safe. I'm on the ground. I even took my steps down. There's one left on the tree. And she's still just sitting there looking at me. Look. Alrighty, I'm back in the truck. This is the road. And this is where I saw the buck this morning walking right or trotting right down here. And then he dropped down right by these trees. And that's about where I go in. I go in over here across the creek. So he's following that same trail. My tree is, oh, it's through the woods, like right up over here. And there's the creek bottom right over there. Anyway, that's it. That's where I saw the buck I've been looking for walking down this road right here. There's a fresh rub um right on the flat over here so i'm gonna go over there maybe this evening but we'll see